The seniors also showed support for a re-employment age of 68 years old and higher. About 9 in 10 seniors aged 50 years or older say they are in full support of a higher retirement age of 63 years old and up. A survey showed. The National Trades Union Congress NTUC and the People's Action Party's seniors group PAPSG collaborated to advance senior citizens' interests through a survey. The survey also showed that around 80% of respondents are in favor of a re-employment age of 68 and higher. Conducted from 7 to August 21, the survey collected responses from 1. 471 individuals, all aged 50 and above. The survey's goal was to gain insights into seniors' workplace aspirations. This workplace support survey was unveiled last September 23rd. During an International Day of Older Persons IDOP event held at Amora Hotel. Commissioned by PAPSG and NTAK U Women and Family NTAK UWEF, the survey revealed a strong preference among seniors for raising both the retirement and re-employment age. Despite the positive outlook on extended employment, the survey uncovered concerns related to negative employer attitudes. These concerns include age discrimination 63.4%, inflexible working arrangements along working hours 59.6%, and limited availability of suitable job opportunities 52.6%. The results also indicated that 61.5% of senior workers are interested in pursuing further career advancement opportunities. And 65.9% of participants consider the availability of flexible work arrangements as influential in their decision to continue working post-retirement. PIPS IDOP 2023 organizing Chair Yip Hon Wang hopes the government will promote more flexible work opportunities for seniors. As many desire part-time work and the ability to alternate between work and leisure. In response to the survey findings, 12 companies have reaffirmed their commitment to creating age-friendly workplace environments. These companies, including Chai Tire Maintenance, Creative Eateries, First Sight International Private Limited and Lifelong Learning Academy collectively impact nearly 4,000 employees. The companies have pledged to raise retirement and re-employment ages, implement flexible work strategies, and combat ageism in the workplace.